यहाँ पे सबके गांडे फट गए लेडीज एंड जर्मन इट इज है It is indeed happening. I want drop a thumbs up. I want to know your thoughts because this is by far the biggest story going around and not many have covered it yet, but the biggest uh news channel or I mean the biggest creator on the platform that that is covering is Bruh. Unbox Therapy. I want to know his thoughts and let me know your thoughts. Let's uh check this out. PlayStation is planning industry shaking acquisition in response to Xbox Activision oh, deal damn. says an analyst. Ooh, key critical. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. PlayStation versus Xbox. If you know who that is, uh drop a comment. In fact, I might have it in the title so you know. Who will win the war? The war that's been raging for decades. Whoever has more money. Despite multiple setbacks, Bruh. Microsoft are continuing on their attempt to acquire Activision. For months, Activision mm. has been bickering with regulators and companies across the world about the deal, most significantly with regards to the future exclusivity of ch -ch -ch call oh dude you, you want to know this this would be insane though you know for all this time sony's like you cannot buy it man you cannot get it and they go ahead and they buy the rockstar games i take you that would be some of the craziest thing ever and i'm all up for it man i really am all up for it because this is gonna be insane in the gaming realm but here's the thing okay to cut sony some slack the, the facts are facts here guys to cut sony some slack apparently the situation here is that the rumor apparently su suggests that sony will be buying take to rockstar games in response to this activision deal if it goes through oh shit! Oh, yeah oh shiza right oh shiza exactly they will only buy it then but if this deal doesn't go through they're not gonna buy and we all know rockstar is uh, 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 sony is playing chess Bruh. because they have a direct connection they have a good relationship with uh, rockstar games they like to have a little bit of that exclusive content but a lot of people that what they're getting wrong in this situation here is that even if sony gets take two and rockstar games gta 6 will never be exclusive let's just talk about that because the first thing that comes to a lot of people mind is that <laughs> is, 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 is gta 6 gonna be exclusive to uh playstation Bruh. probably not let's keep about 50 gta is massive it's a massive franchise that's not gonna happen but best case scenario they can make some content that exclusive maybe give people a little bit of the shark card like yeah hey, hey you go right or what the best they could do is they will threaten microsoft and microsoft will be doing the same they will say microsoft will be saying that yo see we got call of duty do not make gta 6 exclusive because if you do that we're gonna be going ahead and make call of duty exclusive and same goes for sony right if microsoft goes ahead and they're like bro like we're gonna make call of duty exclusive sony is gonna be like we got that gta 6 Oh shit. oh shit! So, that, that's, I, I, in my honest opinion though, it's good for gamers. Because if you're worried that Call of Duty is ever gonna go exclusive, maybe like 10 years later, 5 years later, 10 years later, if it's ever gonna go exclusive on Xbox, if you're worried about that, Sony getting this is gonna be good in that, in a, in a way. Obviously, uh, we should not be having third party games exclusives on any platform first parties are fine but if microsoft is really gonna get activision sony's gonna get rockstar games but are they, but do they really have that money uh you let me know thoughts on this one guys Duty. initially microsoft said that making cod and xbox xbox exclusive wouldn't be profitable but then confessed it's something they'd think about in several years mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. As reported by GG Recon, PlayStation are reportedly eyeing Take Two Interactive, which would be major. Oh shit! Oh, Industry shit. analyst Lumberjack Ride tweeted, "Have it on extremely good word that if Microsoft acquires Activision Blizzard, Sony is going after Take Two to counter it." Three of my trusted and almost always correct sources confirmed that to me. Oh my! What? Oh my! What? Hey yo! Hey yo! Cut the pull the pump the brakes. Three, three of my trusted and almost always correct sources, but you are wrong. wrong. You are always manipulating. Okay, I was not aware of that. I, yeah, I heard the rumor that it can be exclusive, but three of the most trusted, almost never wrong, our sources are saying that it can actually go through. That is wild. That is wild. Indeed. Huge ramifications. Take Two Interactive owns Rockstar Games. GTA. If this deal went ahead, both GTA and Red Dead Redemption franchises could end up becoming PlayStation exclusives. <laughs> it's like an arena and everyone's yeah. like, yeah, 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 yeah. Go, 
go. The Coliseum. The Coliseum. PlayStation on one side. <laughs> Xbox on the other. Which do you think, which combo wins? Microsoft Bruh. plus Activision or Sony plus Take-Two? Yo, Sony plus Take-Two, man. Listen, I, listen, I'm big on Call of Duty. The only big game that I care in this Activision, from Activision, is Call of Duty. But recently, Call of Duty has been doo-doo, man. It has been Shiza. I'm actually hoping for that Call of Duty 2024. They're making another Call of Duty this year, but nobody cares. It's coming from Sledgehammer Games, uh, Sledgehammer My Balls. But I care about them zombies. And Call of Duty 2024 is apparently going to be that Black Ops 2 remake. It's going to be a new game, but it's going to have zombies inspired by Black Ops 2. These are the rumors going around. So Activision got that Call of Duty. And Take Two, the only game I care from Take Two is, let's be real, GTA 6. Bruh. So it's gonna be neck and neck. And GTA 6, I mean, that's gonna be the biggest game on planet, my guy. Dude, that's a tough one. Yeah. They're both enormous I'm, franchises. I'm biased to Take Two. <gasps> yeah. More so than Activision. You're biased. Well, actually, you know what? They have Overwatch. Activision. Yeah, Blizzard. Oh, man, that one's tough. I don't know. Oh. It is tough. It is you tough. You can't though. even place a bet on it. I, I only care for Call of Duty from Activision uh, and GTA with, with Take Two Rockstar. It is tough. It is tough. What you all care about? Yeah, I, I don't think I can. It's important to remember that this is all a rumor for now. Still, it's one that could truly change the industry in the coming years if it yeah. proves to be true. I mean, Take Two would Very have. Very unlikely, though. Take right? Two would have to be into it, it as well. Like, that's the other part people don't talk about. They're like, yeah, sure, they could get a deal done. No problem. Yeah. I don't know. I, I mean, look at the complexity of the Activision deal. <laughs> but obviously, is it is a. It Take Two is smaller. It's like 20 billion. That's a lot of money. That's a lot of money. But Activision is 70 billion, though. An aggressive move. And if it were to happen and go through the Activision deal, so the pressure is going to be on Sony to do something similar at that scale we're not talking about some small time game developer publisher whatever we're talking about big scale if we're talking mm. call of duty we're talking the biggest scale and, and uh, if this really happens everybody okay get, get your 500 iq to use okay everybody Bruh. gather on okay gather on if this really happens do you think that's a good thing one if you think that's a good thing two if you think that's a bad thing i guess we can all agree exclusives are just bad okay and third party exclusive that is that's just bad, okay? But if Sony wanna have exclusive games, then Microsoft deserve to have their exclusive games. Vice versa, okay? But in the end, we shouldn't be having third-party exclusive games on any platform. It's like you buying a wrong piece of plastic and you get shamed on. Oh, well, now you cannot play that game. You know what I mean, right? Nobody likes that. I honestly believe that if Sony really buys because of this Activision deal going through, I think the best Sony is gonna do is just threaten them, right? This is gonna be like a schlong measuring contest behind the scenes where they will know if you make Call of Duty exclusive, we're gonna make GTA 6 exclusive and vice versa. And nobody actually, and th this is why nobody actually will. This is the same case with the nukes, right? If you fire the nuke, I got the nukes. I'm gonna fire it too, right? And then nobody really fires and ladies and gentlemen this actually just happened as well they are really doing it man really doing it click on this video on the screen or click the video on the left we had this brand new teaser image for gta 6 check these videos out guys and i will see you right there